Well, things are warming up and getting quite toasty for your afternoon plans. Looking at temperatures right now, ranging anywhere between a low to upper 80s. Not much of a departure when it comes to the feel like numbers, but the major headline will be the south winds returning and also much humid air mass is going to be settling in. That's going to set us up for even hotter temperatures. We close out your work week. 85 degrees currently feel like temperature of 86 here in Omaha. Live dual pole Doppler radar animated over the past hour. So it's all quiet and looking further upstream. Guys, there's a big void of just cloud free conditions all throughout the uh, Great Plains in the upper Midwest and that will continue for us for the rest of the afternoon right into the evening just in time for the final edition of jazz on the green if you have plans to head down to turn the park it will be hot it will be a tad bit muggier around four and five o'clock with a high temperature of 94 degrees lower 90s around seven o'clock still remaining on, quite on the mild side with temperatures cooling into the lower 80s and also check this out final full well, final uh, super moon of the year uh, happening tonight uh, peaking around 836 is going to have great viewing for tonight with clear skies lasting in mid to upper 60s for morning lows still remaining clear as we get closer to your Friday afternoon. But check this out. It's going to get even warmer and hotter as we head closer to the weekend with impact weather moving in high temperature in the mid to upper 90s it's going to feel closer to 105 to 102 for your Saturday and also for your Sunday. And this is the overall setup. We're going to be tracking for this weekend again, something we've been seeing through most of your summer season with this high pressure digging further down to the south and west, kicking, kicking a jet screen further up to the north near the Canadian border. So that's going to be acting as a conveyor belt for any type of cold front, any type of rain activity we could see. That's not going to be happening for us for this weekend. But check this out. It's going to be eventually breaking down as we head into next week. It's jet stream moving further closer to us, but again, that's going to give us more chances of much active weather. And according to the Climate Prediction Center, that's also hinting towards much cooler, below average temperatures for the next six to 10 days. And we have that on the seven day forecast. Remaining rain free all throughout the uh, next four days or so, but impact weather because of the high heat and humidity with temperatures retreating back into the upper 90s will feel like temperatures anywhere between 100 to 105. So another round of more dangerous, hot and humid conditions for this weekend. But check it out. We've got more rain part of the picture later down the road as early as I'll say Monday afternoon into Monday evening. But check out those temperatures cooling into the low to mid 80s for highs. And for weather updates anytime, download the KTV mobile app. Interactive.